In Vanishing Act, the enduring mystery behind the legendary Doolittle raid over Tokyo, Dan Hampton delves deep into one of World War II's most audacious aerial operations, the Doolittle Raid. The book provides comprehensive coverage of the historic event from its conception to its execution, exploring the strategic, human, and technical dimensions that made it a remarkable feat in military history. At the heart of the story is Lieutenant Colonel James Jimmy Doolittle, an aviation pioneer and leader of the Daring Raid. The operation was conceived in the wake of the Japanese attack on Pearl Harbor on December 7, 1941, which had left, left the United States reeling and desperate for a counterstroke to boost American morale and shake Japan's confidence. Doolittle was chosen to lead the mission due to his expertise in aviation and his reputation for taking on risky challenges. The plan, fraught with peril, involved launching medium bombers from the deck of an aircraft carrier, a feat never attempted before. Sixteen B-25 Mitchell bombers, typically land-based, were modified for the task, which included taking off from the short runway of the USS Hornet. Hampton provides detailed insights into the modifications and extensive training the crews underwent, emphasizing the innovation and adaptability demanded by such an unprecedented operation. As the mission unfolded, the plan hit an unexpected snag. The task force, consisting of the Hornet and its escorts, was spotted by Japanese picket ships 170 miles further from Japan than planned, forcing an early launch of the bombers. This increased the risk of not having sufficient fuel to reach safe territory after bombing Tokyo and the likelihood of the crews being captured if they were forced to crash land or bail out over enemy territory. Undeterred, Doolittle and his men proceeded with the raid. On April 18, 1942, the bombers successfully took off from the Hornet and headed towards Japan. The raiders managed to bomb their targets in Tokyo and other Japanese cities, catching the enemy off guard and delivering a psychological blow to a nation that had believed itself invulnerable to direct attack. Despite the mission's success, the crews faced daunting challenges. None of the aircraft reached the intended airfields in China. Some crash-landed, others ditched at sea, and a few managed to land in the Soviet Union. The harrowing experiences of the raiders as they evaded capture and sought safety form a significant part of the narrative. Many faced extreme hardship, hunger, and danger, with some being captured by the Japanese and subjected to brutal treatment as prisoners of war. Hampton's account includes the broader impact of the raid. It catalyzed a shift in Japanese strategy, prompting them to pursue aggressive actions that led to the pivotal Battle of Midway, where American forces won a critical victory. The raid also marked a turning point in the war's public relations, lifting American spirits by demonstrating that the U.S. could take the fight directly to Japan. The lasting legacy of the Doolittle Raid extends beyond its immediate tactical or psychological effects. Hampton explores the theme of heroism and sacrifice, showing how the raid became a symbol of American grit and determination. The daring nature of the mission and the courage of the men who carried it out have been commemorated and celebrated in the annals of military history. Moreover, the author contemplates the strategic lessons learned from the raid, particularly its demonstration of air power's potential and its role in warfare. It signified the beginning of an era where long-range bombing campaigns would become a staple of military strategy, shaping future conflicts. Hampton's account is both captivating and meticulously researched. He paints a vivid picture of the individual raiders capturing their fears, resolve, and camaraderie. The narrative is rich with first-hand accounts, military records, and historical analyses, offering a comprehensive understanding of the complexities involved in the mission. Towards the end of the book, Hampton delves into the mystery alluded to in the title, grappling with some of the unanswered questions that persist about the raid. Chief among these is the fate of some crew members whose ultimate outcomes remained unclear, the notable intelligence failures on the part of the Japanese, and the curious decisions made by the Americans in executing the raid. While the Doolittle Raid did not have a significant strategic impact on the outcome of the war in terms of physical damage, its symbolism and morale boost were invaluable. This operation would inspire and inform future military undertakings, and its participants would be remembered as heroes for generations to come. 
In Vanishing Act, Dan Hampton offers a tribute to the audacity and skill of the Doolittle Raiders and provides a penetrating look into one of World War II's most intriguing and inspiring episodes. The book stands as an engaging and thoughtful examination of an event that, despite being just a vanishing act, left an indelible mark on history. You can listen to the full audiobook for free by following the URL in the description.